Hi, I'm Philip Dunn, an Applications Instructor for New Horizons, and I'm here with another tip for working efficiently with PowerPoint. So what a lot of people do in Word is go slide by slide, typing in each slide, typing in the, in the appropriate boxes, which is good, adding each one, it just takes a long time. You have, to, you have to stop typing, click in each box, and so on. You have to keep going through each one of these and adding everything. Uh, and that just takes a long time. Now, you could type in the outline view, but a nice way to do it is to write it in Word. And then the trick is to turn this simple list into a outline. So there's a couple ways to do it, but I think the easiest way is to use the built-in Word styles. Everything that's going to be heading one is going to turn into a slide title for a slide. Anything that's heading two or smaller will be a bullet point on the slide. I'm going to start by pressing Control A to select everything and just make everything heading two, which would be all bullets. But then I can more easily select each of the slide titles. I'm holding the control key down as I go to select more than one item, but I can just convert them all into heading one up here at the top. So this functions as a outline. If I go to the outline view in Word, you can very easily see how the outline structure is set up. And that's all that PowerPoint needs. So I'm gonna go ahead and save this. Save it in an easy place. And I like to name it outline so that I know what I'm looking for. Now remember, you do need to exit out of Word. It doesn't work if this file's open. All right, so now we're back in PowerPoint. I can delete all of these slides. And then I'll go down to New Slide, click the bottom half. And then at the bottom, I can choose Slides from Outline. Navigate to find your outline. There it is. And then when I click Insert, it's going to automatically make a new slide for every outline level that has heading one, the bullets automatically come from anything that is heading two. So we're almost done here. You can tell that the styles are, are imported from Word and I want to be able to use a, a PowerPoint theme. So I'm going to select all of my slides by clicking any one of the thumbnails, pressing Control A for select all. And I want to click up here on reset and that will reset all of these slides to whatever theme that you're using. I'm going to go ahead and change slide one so that the layout is a title slide. Now I can do design and pick any one of my themes that I like. That will look pretty good. Go with that one. And now I have a full PowerPoint presentation from Word. In the PowerPoint 365 part one class, you'll learn some amazing things like developing a PowerPoint presentation performing advanced text editing operations, adding and arranging graphical elements, modifying graphical elements, and preparing to deliver your presentation. If you like that tip and want more, click like and subscribe. And if you're interested in taking the New Horizons PowerPoint Part 1 class in which we covered developing a PowerPoint presentation, click the link in the description. And I'll see you in class.